pressure to blind. Hey everyone, it's Scott, Project Repair Online. Uh, thanks for coming back and humoring me and watching the channel, all that good stuff. Thanks guys, I uh, appreciate it. Uh, today's episode, I'm gonna be rehousing, uh, well basically I'm gonna be rehousing three spiders, but on this episode you'll see one of them. And that one is going to be the uh, Lampropelma Arborico, no, Lampropelma Nigerimum Arboricola. Soon to be known as the Formio Chylus Arboricola. These are what I'm going to rehouse it into. So look at it stinking. So the first thing I'm going to do obviously is clean it. Uh, so I've got three of these tanks that I'm going to clean. So that's the first thing, right? And remember, when you clean your tanks, nothing but water and elbow grease. So no kind of chemical, even doesn't matter how many times you rinse it, no chemicals, nothing, no soaps, no chemicals, nothing. Hot water, elbow grease, work it all out. So all this crap is gonna be taken off it, all the um, old spider excrement, that's gonna be taken off it. Let's do this. So then, next on the agenda is to um, select a lovely piece of cork bark for this tank here. So, of course, the flat stuff is not needed. And uh, before we move on, thanks to David Dance for House of Bugs, from House of Bugs, sorry, for sorting me up with all this cork. Some really nice pieces in here. So. This is still drying, right? So I just want to get it for like a size comparison. <gasps> oh, excuse me. So let's have a look through. Well, that's nice. That's a nice piece. So it's going to be obviously substrate to about here. That could be a nice piece. That's a contender. Look at these. They're amazing pieces of cork. Far too big, so I'll straight out. This one's been far too big as well, although that is stunning. I'm gonna have to work out something to do with that one. Look at that. That is awesome. Oh, oh there's another contender be everything. Oh, there's some really gnarly ones in there. Alright, so. Alright, so that one is more like. I can make it right in the centre. Do you reckon? But there we come to the top. So that's a contender. What else we got here? Oh man, look at that! See for a smaller spider. That would be lush. Some really, really, really awesome pieces of bark here. Oh, oh. I think this is one of I think I think we found a, I think we found our piece. Look at that. Just to check inside. Oh yeah, I think so. This is gonna be the front, so we'll make the make it kind of lean towards the front, I think. That'll look well cool, wouldn't it? This one's pretty cool, actually. There's another spider in it, I'll have to clean that one out first. Oh, look at that. Ah, I think I'm gonna go for this one. The double sided. Look at it. That is wicked, isn't it? 
Really, really cool, gnarly little piece of cork. Yep, so that one. This one. So plenty of cork to um, rehouse loads and loads and loads of spiders. Happy days, man. Happy days. So stage two, right, is uh, behind the camera here. We've got um, coir, so um, substrate, cooking, making, you know, wetting down, giving it some time to uh, really expand and be nice and damp. You can see my hands are dirty there. And in here, I've just got some boiled water. And then this is sphag dried sphagnum moss. Now this is the stuff you it's come from, um, from China, I think, so from eBay. Uh, I'm just going to I just soak up most of this, this boiled water. It's, it's not very nice stuff, i got to be honest. I'd much rather get the, the um, fresh, live sphagnum moss. And then moss, right, has got an amazing ability to come back from the dead but it needs light and that's something that I don't have um, in here at the moment but that's something I'm going to rectify soon so this should be fine I'll strain this off now and we can start constructing it I also got look a big water bowl Big, big water bowl, really important, and I'll set that into the, the substrate so it's not sticking out or it's unsightly. You'll set, you'll set it inside. Cool. Now, Lampropelmus, uh, lamp so the or forming Achylus, obviously they're arboreal tarantulas, so, um, you know, usually people would say to give maybe an inch of substrate or something, because, you know, they climb up the tree, tree dwellers, but Lampropelma especially, or now they're going to be called forming Achylus, arboricola, they love digging at the bottom of um, of the cork retreat so I'm going to give it a little bit more than I would for kind of an avic and we can compress it down a bit as well not too compressed at the moment because I want to measure now this Where's he going? Is he going in that way? Yeah. Push him right in as well. No, nope, that's not working. No, nope, that didn't work. See, so it's trial and error.
Right. I'm going to pop a little bit more substrate in there. In the front. And I'm pushing down. And then this here is where I'm going to put the water bowl. So let's kind of take that out a bit. as possible as much water out and then we can start to uh, pop down some and I'm going to put it behind you like that bottom first in there. Like that. I'm doing this backwards as well obviously because I want the front to be on camera. I hate that water bottle being by there. But it's got to uh, straight now. Soaking myself for water here. Yeah. I want to get some nice green ones. You know, hook them in. Hook that into the wood. on the other side. Alright, nice really deep substrate, obviously the label will have to change on the top, the label will be here, I'll pop something to cover that, I'll try and get it off, uh, yeah, so the, the new, so these are going to be very, well they're exactly like the new tanks I'm going to build, but my tanks will be without the black on the top, I don't know if you could just peel, I don't want to just peel that off, bugger, I've peeled it off now. Anyway, let's have a quick look inside. So, one more thing left to do, and that's fill the water bowl, and then we can do the fun bit, and we can put the spider inside this. And fingers crossed, it's not going to go tits up, <laughs> because they are a little bit gnarly. So we'll put a bit of water in. And 
a bit of sphagnum moss floating in it already. Now, you guys, if you wonder why right, your water dishes go overnight, two reasons. Either you've got some sphagnum moss in the water bowl and it's just sucking like a siphon out of it, or the water bowl is too, um, too sunken into the coir and the coir on the top layer there is actually sucking the water out. It's quite simple. So I need the tweezers. Yeah, just keep your water bowl clear. Happy days. Let's get that spider in there. Wash my hands. Right, careful here. Yeah. Hold on. Oh, where's my torch? There's a bell roll, remember like I was saying? So. There's a burrow there. Now I think what I'll do is I will cover one end. Ah, oh, I can see the spider. Right, so let's cover that end. Like that. Oh, shit. Right, she's about here. To, uh, to be honest with you, I'm breaking myself, man. So if I can get it to go down here. Ooh. Oh, she bite in. Who is she? Out. So I can have a look. See, so using the two handed. Oh, she is there, look. She's gone back in now. Right. This is the only problem when you've got a, um, a cork bark tube. Where is she? There she is. Right. So. And she's gone back inside. Come on, you. Right, you're there, look. There she is, look, see? Can you see her? Well, I've got to find a way of keeping her out. No, 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 no. Keep, keep out. Stay out. Ah, oh, there we are. Right, what if I just... No, 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 ah, 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 ah. Right, where are you? Come on. Right. My hands are very close to her now. That's uncomfortable. Don't go back in, don't go back in, don't go back in. Yes. Got her, right. Well, let's have a look at her then. It's very dry in there, so I'm glad I'm rehousing her now. No, I can't see at all whether you can see anything. Oh yes, you can, that's not too bad. And that was relatively, leave her there for a second, relatively painless, wasn't it? One for one second, my hand was a little bit too close to her for my liking. 
Um, but uh, but all together, pretty damn good. Right, so leave her there for a second. Let's whack her in. Now, it should be, right, it should be an easy thing. Um, now, I sit on my phone, no, it's over there, cool. So it should be an easy thing. So we should, right, be able to take the top off, pop her here, use the fat end of the tweezers, and try and walk her down. Here she is. Uh, just curled up nicely. Maybe we'll feed her as well. So, uh, let's see how this goes. I'm just gonna pop her here. Just like this. Now what I'm gonna try and do, right, see the entrance of, the, of this of the retreat here? I'm gonna pop the cup over it. And then just nudge her gently. Come on. Now you don't want to, obviously, she's gonna start biting now. And look at that. See? Straight in, straight in the retreat. Happy days. Now there are many, many methods uh, for rehousing spiders and I've seen like really intricate ones with holes and everything, holes in the pot and you poke through things so that you move the spider that way. Honestly, right, literally, you just get in the way of yourself. You can't get the angles. You're just really, really, really either gonna stress the spider out or you're gonna put yourself in danger by not being able to get the, uh, the Welsh word is gavel, the, um, uh, the grip on it basically, isn't it? So, um, all you gotta do, right, is be very, very calm and patient. And if you just walk the spider in, then it's better for you and it's better for the spider. So yeah, thank you everyone for joining me. Um, like, comment, subscribe and keep coming back to this channel. Um, remember there's a show in Glasgow this weekend, first Scottish show ever. Uh, details will be in the description below. Uh, keep an eye out on other YouTubers channels for a sneaky collaboration this week as well. Um, it was really really fun. It's uh, really well known and quite a big YouTuber. So um, you should all see that as well. Um, cheers guys. Stay safe. Ta-da.